This video is presented by Rashid Bashu team. The Dr. Rashid Bashu is the first scientist and gemologist in Africa. All silicates have a basic structural unit that is a tetrahedron with an oxygen ion O at each apex, and a silicon ion C in the middle, forming SiO4-4-. In tectosilicates, framework silicates, each oxygen ion is shared between two tetrahedra, linking all the tetrahedra together to form a framework. Since each O is shared between two tetrahedra only half of it belongs to the C ion in either tetrahedron, and if no other components are present then the formula is SiO2, as in quartz. Aluminium ions Al, can substitute for some of the silicon ions, forming, Alo45- tetrahedra. If the substitution is random the ions are said to be disordered, but in Ha in the Al and C in the tetrahedral framework are fully ordered. C has a charge 4 plus, but the charge on Al is only 3 plus. If all the cations, positive ions, are C then the positive charges on the C's exactly balance the negative charges on the O's. When Al replaces C there is a deficiency of positive charge, and this is made up by extra positively charged ions, cations, entering the structure, somewhere in between the tetrahedra. In Ha in these extra cations are sodium Na plus and calcium Ka2 plus, and in addition the negatively charged sulfate group, SO42 minus is also present. In the Ha in structure the tetrahedra are linked to form six membered rings that are stacked up in an ab cab sequence along one direction, and rings of four tetrahedra are stacked up parallel to another direction. The resulting arrangement forms continuous channels that can accommodate a large variety of cations and anions.